car. In fact, something a bit more dramatic. <laughs> I'm sorry. I was wrong. I know that now. Right? Please, just... How could you do this to me? Um, seem... Oh, absolutely fabulous, you two. Absolutely fabulous. Now, I was wondering if you could help me. There's a couple of fresh face actors who want to audition. Could you help me put them through their paces? Yeah, yeah, sure. Oh, excellent. Send them in. Me, 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 me. Good day! Yes, I see. When one is acting in a soap opera such as Crackadale, yes, one must act like one is doing very little. <laughs> Sounds like one's kind of job. <laughs> yes, ideally, it should look like you're not acting at all. Believe me, I don't think that's going to be a problem. Nah. <laughs> right, OK, let's start with you, Sam. OK, yeah. Right, if yeah. you could uh, read uh, Isabel's part. OK, yeah, of course, yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry, I was wrong. I know that now, please, just... Yes, yes. Uh, maybe we could try that again, but with a smidge more emotion. Yes. Isabel, if you would be so kind. I'm sorry, right? I was wrong. And I know that now. Please, just. <laughs> you call that acting? You want to see sad? Oh, I'll show you sad, all right? Get ready for this. Right, come on. find that was sadness, didn't you not see? Were well, you not paying attention no, to I the tears and the crying? I don't know if it was that, was it? Oh, right. No, it's because you've seen it on its own. You need to see it as part of the full scene. Oh, do I? Yes. yes. Well, OK, Rosie, would you be some kind? Hang on, hang on, just let me reload. <laughs> Go for it, babes. I hate you. I never want to see you ever again. Oh! Top tip for angry acting, what you do, get your finger right, yeah. through in your top. Yes. Yeah. 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 How could you do this to me? <laughs> I hate you. Oh, sorry, I was wrong. I know that now. Please, just. I am the one I said you were gay. And scene. Oh, Matt Thomas Rhodes, can we never argue in real life, please? Because that was terrifying. Fire. Come here. Oh, oh it's not funny. What amazing. So, when do we start? Hmm, let me see. Uh, how about never? You two were dreadful. Oh, I just don't believe for a single moment that anyone would act like that in real life. Jack, here's how it works. Our two contestants will be asked questions. Whoever gets the closest to the correct answer will earn three seconds to crank their celebrity up higher and higher towards this bulging balloon of gunge. Oh, yeah. Now, whoever cranks their celeb high enough to pop the balloon will win and go through to our double or drop finale at the end of the show. Facing the gunge in splatter seat number one is Emmerdale's Rosie Benther. Feeling? Oh, I'm dreading it. I'm dreading it. Really? Oh, Ro Rosie, I'm feeling that white was a bad choice. <laughs> <laughs> well, the best of luck, Rosie. Hey, all right. And in spatter seat number two, it's Emma Dale's Isabel Steele. <laughs> How are you feeling, Isabel? Oh, great. Bring it on. Yeah. Bring oh, it yeah. on. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Right. Now, uh, Rosie is playing for. Oh, uh, 
How are you, Erwa? Okay. Excellent. How old are you? I'm 12. What do you do for a living? I don't have a job. You don't have a job? Oh. <laughs> uh, what's your favourite smell? Perfume. Perfume, nice. Now, I know that's a good, that's a sensible answer. Well yeah. done, Erwa. Yeah, Erwa, everyone. Hey! Now we're here. Isabel is playing for... Charlie. Charlie. Hey, it doesn't look so nervous, mate. It's all right. Uh, how old are you, Charlie? Um, ten. Ten, OK. And what is your favourite bird? Um, it's, it's a robin. A robin? Yes! And what, what do robins do? They go... <laughs> They eat mealworms. They eat mealworms. <laughs> Brilliant. What a great fact. I love a robin. <laughs> Factual and entertaining this year. <laughs> well, before we get started, let's see exactly what the slime is that's positioned above our celebs today. Rosie, if you win, believe it or not, <laughs> you will be splattered by soggy scrambled egg. <laughs> About I'm that. Ecstatic. Delighted, <laughs> delighted. And if Isabel, if you were to win, you would be smothered in sloppy peas. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Lovely stuff. Well, sit tight as we play Splatter Jack. Right. Right, right. so uh, you grab the little board there and you grab this one. Here's your first question. Best of luck, guys. What is the combined age of myself and Mark? Combined age. Charlie's put a number and then put a question mark on there. <laughs> <laughs> right. Did on the fence a bit there, Charlie. <laughs> Charlie. Uh, uh, just called him George. Uh, 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 <laughs> what number have you gone for? The combined age. I've gone for the number 58. Oh. Easy. Easy. <laughs> Easy. The, the problem is, is that the audience know that you're miles off. <laughs> <laughs> what have you gone for, Charlie? 50. 50? Question mark. Oh. Will you point down? <laughs> it's very lovely of you, though. Uh, I can uh, tell you that the actual answer is... All right! <laughs> it's not 77, but you're close, love. You'd, you'd have won the point. <laughs> it's not 67! I wish it was. It's 71 years! Oh. Yeah, Ooh. yeah. Yeah, we're uh, not going to tell you who's what. Uh, which means, Erwa, uh, you are closest, so you have now won three seconds to crank up your celebrity. So if you stand on the podium there, get your hands on the cranker, the best of luck. Three, two, one, go! Yes! Oh, that's good. Yes. <laughs> that was good, that. All right, next question, guys. How many letters are there in the word... Supercalifragilisticexpialidocious. Easy for me to say. Quiet in the audience. Quiet in the audience. OK, let's go with you, Charlie, first. How many letters do you think? 30. 30. Over here, Erwa, what we going for? 64. 64. It's a lot, isn't it, Erwa? It's a lot. <laughs> OK, <laughs> I can tell you that the correct answer is... 34! Oh, Charlie! You did very, very well there, so... You get lucky, it's ready, it's ready, you need. Know. <laughs> All right, you got, All right. you got three seconds of cranking. Three, two, one, go! Stop! <laughs> Come back. Isabel, as you were being cranked up then, you looked like you were laughing because you were going... <laughs> <laughs> right, here comes the next question. In what year did Prince William and Kate Middleton get married? Right, Erwa, what's your answer? 2010. 2010. Turn it round, let's have a look. 1987. 1987! <laughs> hey, I tell you what, Prince William's looking good, isn't he? <laughs> hey? Didn't get me started at Kate Middleton. Come on, is she 15? Right, answers. Uh, I can tell you that the answer was 2011. You were wrong! Yeah! Make sure it's a good one. Three, two, one, crank away. <laughs> <laughs> Look at her face. Look at her face. <laughs> All right, next question. Listen, how many miles long is the River Thames? In miles. All right, turn the board around so we can see the answer, Charlie. You've gone for? 100. 100. <laughs> 
I love the tiny writing. <laughs> uh, 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 say that again. 36. 36, 36 miles. miles. Okay, well, the answer is... Oh, this is good. 215 miles. So, Charlie, well done. Very good. <laughs> it's really close. It's close, this guy. It's almost neck and neck, that. That's brilliant. Right, here comes your next question. How many bones are there in a human foot? Uh, well, turn your board round. What are you going for? 17. You think there are 17 bones in a human foot? And Charlie, turn your board around, mate. What are you going for? 10. You've gone for 10. He's a tiny writer. <laughs> OK, who was closest? Well, I can tell you that the answer was 26. Oh, who was? You were the closest there. This is good. You keep back and forth in. Slow as possible. Yeah. Slow as possible. She wants you to do it. It depends how kind you've been. Uh, well, your three seconds start now. <laughs> Serious. Okay. How many seats are there in the Old Trafford football stadium? <laughs> uh, well, in Old Trafford, Man United's football stadium, how many seats are there? 204. <laughs> That's a bad crowd, isn't it? <laughs> okay, Charlie, what have you gone for? Turn it around. 3,000. 3,000! Wow, that's actually... I think, Rosie, I think you might be all right, love. <laughs> yeah, don't get it. Okay, the exact number is 74,879. So, Charlie, you win the point. Well done. Yeah. Okay. Oh, it's, oh, it's ready. It's ready. Okay, three, two, one, go! at the end of an episode of Emma Day, isn't it? <laughs> I've never seen Emma Day. I've never seen this episode. <laughs> OK, guys, best of luck. Here comes the question. <laughs> How many gold medals did Team GB win at the Rio Olympics in 2016? Quiet in the audience. Uh, well, what have we gone for? Twelve. Twelve. Gone for twelve. And Charlie, turn it around. What have you gone for? Thirty. Thirty. OK. The answer is... <laughs> 27! Which means Charlie wins! <laughs> oh, what an anti-climax! <laughs> oh, my God! Oh, no! Oh, my God! He is coming! He's coming! <laughs> Hold on! Oh, Wait! We're going to come Sam! Guys, Obviously, there seems to be some sort of technical problem with Isabel's. Mm. So, so maybe we should just go for Rosie's yeah. instead. Contestants, give them a round of applause. Right. Come with me. Across. Oh. Let's go. It's 
time for another fantastic performance from our Cracker Jack players. But this time, three members of our studio audience need to watch this performance very, very closely because afterwards, we will be testing them to see if they've been paying attention. It's a game that we like to call Watch It! <laughs> Let's meet today's contestants. Come on in, guys. Okay, contestant number one, what is your name? Clara. Clara, and what isn't your name? Oh, uh, fruits. Fruits. <laughs> yes, fruits. <laughs> it's that's not the name.